Hello again YouTube and TI community worldwide. I trust you're all doing well. Uh, Shane Gibbs back again for the next episode in my series of YouTube videos. Um, I trust all you guys and girls out there are doing um, are doing okay. Um, going to be uh, a couple of topics that I want to talk about today. But firstly, I just want to um, I just want to thank all of the uh, all of the people that um, have been getting in touch regarding the, uh, the the symptoms that I uh, I talked about in my last uh, in my last video. Um, that's very much appreciated. It's quite nice to actually know how uh, how caring some of my uh, some of my subscribers and the people that have uh, got to know me through my YouTube channel um, feel about um, well, obviously feel about me personally. You know, um, it's really it's really it's really quite nice. And um, yeah, thanks very much, people. It's uh, it's very much appreciated. Uh, I will confirm today that the um, the whatever the burning thing that's disappeared now, um, the arse cheek's still a little bit. Uh, uh, Wafty, but um, I don't know. It almost feels like some kind of trapped nerve in there. I don't know how I trapped a nerve up in there, but um, or on the arse cheek, I really don't know. But uh, yeah, I'm sure it'll disappear. Um, the same as all of these other strange ailments, you know, swellings in teeth and oh, God knows what else that uh, that we're uh, we're put through and have to deal with on a daily basis. So um, today's topic. Uh, there's going to be two topics really. Um, the, the first topic that I think is probably um, probably the most important topic is um, learning how to trust again. Um, Ti and 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 it's and it's part of the uh, I'm, I'm almost certain it's it's part of the way that the program is designed. Uh, as you as you're pretty much aware, if you are a true genuine Ti, um, the isolation factor, uh, turning everyone against you factor. Um, getting harassed and stalked by the police factor, the dodgy mental health uh, system factor, etc, 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 etc. Basically what that does is it actually dehumanizes you and uh, effectively what it does is it doesn't allow you to have any form of trust um, with anything or anybody. Something that I've been um, I've been seeing, and and it's probably one of the re one of the main reasons why I'm so adverse to um, to the old Facebook uh, side of things, and um, and I think you're all pretty much aware now of my uh, my standing and uh, the way that I uh, the way that I perceive um, Facebook as a as a complete waste of time, unless you're utilising it for um, for the benefit of gathering evidence and um, broadcasting what's happening to you in your individual life to uh, to all of the, your loved ones, family and friends, and also building up some kind of uh, paper trail of evidence. Um, but regards to all the groups and uh, eat the perp and cheese the perp and eh, 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 um, that has all come down if it's not infiltrated uh, by dickhead perpetrators or trolls or um, genuinely mentally ill people. Um, effectively, what it comes down to is the trust element. TIs are programmed not to trust. Um, and not to put put their faith and trust in another human being. It's the way the program is designed. It is so 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 important um, to actually get over that and start learning to trust again. You must. Otherwise, where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? Where are you going to be? You know, you're going to be on your own. You're going to be isolated. You're not gonna. If you don't trust anybody, you're literally gonna live out the rest of your days in some dismal situation um, where you're getting absolutely hammered to bits with with uh, with directed energy. Um, you're getting gang stalked to bits by the donuts outside doing all the stupid gang stalking and the home invasions and all that sort of stuff. Um, TI Television is a new um, concept to the UK TI community and you can trust every one of the team, specifically myself and Kieran. Um, you need to learn how to trust again and with that trust will come companionship and with that companionship will, will come a sense of belonging. Um, and I've seen it, we're only sort of two or three months into, uh, into the whole TI television concept uh, and what I'm actually seeing, and it's quite amazing, I'm, I'm actually quite, um, quite overwhelmed with the fact that some of the people that um, we've been interviewing, some of the people that we've that have been coming along to the uh, the various meetings that uh, that we've held over the past few months, um, they initially come in as an individual uh, targeted individual. Um, some come in with over camera uh, uh, covert cameras hooked up and audio recording devices, and um, with no trust 
whatsoever and that is completely understandable but you are you need to learn and how to be a human again you need to learn the people that you can trust apart from the people that you obviously cannot trust and so effectively um, by coming on board with TI television you I have seen I have seen the the emotional difference with uh, with individuals. Uh, I'm not going to start naming names, but effectively, what I've seen is, is I've seen them turn up to uh, prior to uh, to meeting any of us guys uh, and girls at TI Television. Um, <coughs> excuse me, as a um, isolated, untrusting, um, targeted individual, and by the time they leave, they are completely different. They are completely and utterly different people because they feel the, the trust. We, you know, trust needs. You know, a lot of people say trust needs to be earned. Trust needs to be earned. Now, if you go down that, if you go down that road, you're never going to get anywhere. Not with the TI program. You, we need to start joining up. We need to start shouting out. We need to start coming together. You need to start learning how to trust again. You need to start regaining some of your natural human elements that is taken away from you and and the program is actually designed to unprogram you from being a normal caring loving trusting loyal human being so try and try and take on board what I'm what I'm, what I'm trying to get over here um, you need to, to actually move forward um, not only within your own personal life but also with the uh, the whole concept about uh, working to expose and uh, first of all work to acknowledge to get this program acknowledged by officialdom which we will be doing um, you guys and girls out there you need to learn to trust you need to learn that not everyone is working for the dark side not everyone is a pathetic cowardly gang stalking mind controlled idiot it's essential if you can't trust you can't move forward and if you can't move forward you are up the creek so to speak without a paddle blatantly obvious you know surely you can all see that the, the TI television thing I, I'm actually like I say I'm, I'm, I'm quite overwhelmed with, uh, with with the way that um, that we're being received within the within the UK and not only the UK T, uh, TI community but also with the with the global TI um, TI community, you know the amount of uh, response and um, and contact that we're getting, not only from UK and um, UK-based uh, TIs or survivors, um, the amount of uh, the amount of love that we're actually getting from from American and Australian and uh, and, and foreign um, uh, targeted uh, survivors. So um, try and I know it's not easy I know it's going to be hard but you need to get over the programming that, that has forced you into the isolation you need to learn you need to learn how to trust again you need to learn who who the people that you are effectively going to be coming into contact with especially with myself and the, and the crew at TI television you, you, the, the trust element doesn't affect you know, from us um, we will give everyone a shot and we want as many people to come forward um, we have been doing you know we have been working flat out Kieran's been working flat out Jeff's been doing a, a lot of work behind the scenes and and me personally I've got another thousand flyers to go and uh, to go and get posted off to um, to some UK uh, survivors that uh, have got involved with the um, with the TI television flyer campaign and um, the amount of contributions that have been coming in now um, I can actually now um, send out flyers for um, the subsidies that have been coming in through the uh, through the contributions and donations. Um, the packs of flyers now can be uh, can be sent out for twelve pound fifty, so uh, plus the five pound postage. So that's seventeen pound fifty for your two hundred and fifty professionally printed flyers. If um, if that's something that you want to get involved with, then please get in touch and um, through my email Shane Gibbs two one two at gmail .com and um, anybody that is not in a financial position but they still want half a dozen flies sent through um, I will send them through free of charge um, to UK um, targeted individuals and anybody else that wants them you know like, like I mentioned in the previous in previous videos uh, the amount of um, the amount of flies that are going um, especially small amounts of flies that are going abroad um, is quite it's quite it's quite overwhelming you know um, everybody and anybody that um, is genuine needs to start getting involved with 
maybe not the uh, maybe not the foreign uh, TIs because we can't really have a lot of effect. You know, we, there's no way we're going to start being able to go around and uh, fly around and travel around around Europe. You know, we're just about finding enough money to cover the cost of, of petrol, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, to go out and do these road trips. And uh, I believe there's another road trip coming up in in the uh, in the next couple of weeks. And um, Kieran and I will be uh, will be travelling to a destination, and we have lined up uh, another four four or five um, testimonies um, from survivors that have been in touch with us and uh, had learned to trust, had reached out. What everybody needs to do, you need to learn to be able to trust. You have to trust again. You have to regain some of the some of the dignity and some of the the humanity that this program is designed to destroy in, in, in the individual. So start, you know, think about what I'm trying to say here. You know, this, this is never going to move forward. This is never, or you personally, you, the survivor that's watching this, if you cannot learn to, to trust again, you will go absolutely nowhere. You will remain in your isolation bubble. You will remain targeted. You will remain gang stalked. You will remain the victim break the victim mentality, start learning that there are people out here, i.e. myself and the crew at TR Television and some of the other um, some of the other courageous people that we've been that we've been getting involved with in the uh, in, in the recent past. Um, we're we are here for the cause. We're, there's no ulterior motive behind what we're doing apart from one profile in your story which is going to allow you as in my opinion it's going to allow you an element of protection once your testimony gets gets put, given and, and gets posted up onto the ti television uh, channel and um, but also you'll get a sense of belonging because the amount the the the, the people that, are, that have been involved so far you know we're in constant we're in constant um, communications with them via phone via email um etc 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 you know that they, they feel a sense of belonging you know that they're feeling that that they, they know that they can trust us. So even if it's not us that you want to come through to, start reaching out to people and working out and start working on the fact that you need to learn to trust. Without trust, you move nowhere. Without trust in any relationship, you move nowhere. Absolutely nowhere. And you will remain a victim and not a survivor. So if you want to remain in that victim mentality, um, that this this program forces upon you, um, then that's your choice. But I know that there are hundreds of TIs around the UK now um, that are reaching out and, and they are making contact and um, they've learned to trust. It's very simple. It's very easy being a human being. Um, you just need to learn how to be a human again because the program dehumanizes you destabilizes you destroys any human well aspect of being a human you know care loyalty trust etc 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 um you need to break free you need to start reaching out to either us or other ti's that you have learned to trust you must remember that you've got to start learning how to trust people again it's, just, it's so, so, so essential. Because if you don't, use it, like I mentioned, you know, you're just going to remain a victim. And um, effectively, if we are successful with our agenda at um, TI Television, um, you're not going to be part of it. So, you know, how does that make you feel? To feel that there's going to be pro uh, possibly hundreds of of, uh, of survivors that are um, that are going to be part of probably something that the t the whole TI community, especially you in the UK, has never ever seen or ever ever achieved before. So the decision's yours, and um, learn how to trust. Get out of Facebook. Start meeting up with people. And um, yeah, on, on that note, I just want to. Uh, that's enough about the trust element. I think you get the. I think you get the picture. Um, I just want to give a big shout out to uh, to Laura and the um, and the the, the, the targeted survivor um, crew over in in Ireland. Um, that I believe that there is uh, an, a, an, a meeting that's been arranged um, through. I'm assuming Laura from. Um, targeted individual island I think her, her channel's called 
Um, so any Irish TIs out there that are viewing my channel, please, please, please get in touch with Laura, start reaching out, learn, you can trust Laura and her team that she's put together over there, and even possibly talk about arranging to go along to, to the meeting. Um, Laura, I wish you the best of best of luck. I hope the meeting goes very, very well. Um, I know that you are a proper bona fide warrior, and um, and and if anybody can bring the TI community together over in Ireland, um, then it's going to be you. So I wish you the best of luck. Um, I hope everything goes to plan, and um, I hope you, you get some real good numbers at your uh, at your meeting and. Um, and hopefully you can move forward from there. You know, maybe even start your own kind of version of uh, of TI TV Island, TI Television Island. You know, we don't know unless you try. And but what I can say is that we're having an effect, and I will tell you how I've come to that terms. Um, just recently, I have been communicating with well, I'm communicating with, with UK um, survivors on a daily basis, and for the past couple of days. Uh, I have um, my new BlackBerry has been infiltrated and as soon as I start contacting or calling um, the people that have reached out to me um, I the phone just stops working and it has to be rebooted somebody's getting a little bit worried about what we're doing at TI television they, uh, they have never expected this level of activism this level of of organization from um, a team of survivors here in the UK we're proving you wrong perps and it's pretty obvious that you are pretty powerless to do anything about it you fools foolish foolish <laughs> so every time you interfere all you will do is instill more pressure more courage more persistence from us so you keep attacking, you keep you keep prodding, you keep probing. You will only make us stronger. So I must congratulate all of the, um, especially all you fe you uh, you females out there. I'm, you know, I'm getting to the I'm getting to the uh, the, the, the the strong belief now um, that the TI community is most certainly have got a higher percentage of of um, female survivors than male. That, that that's becoming very very obvious and I've actually heard that on, on numerous occasions from a from from other YouTube videos um, over the years that um, the percentage of of um, female survivors to male survivors is probably I reckon it's got to be 65 35 65 35 uh, male 65% women 35% um, men um, and I'm assuming that, that the only reason for that is because they feel that a woman is possibly an easier target than a bloke. I don't know. I really don't know. But I'm definitely coming to the uh, coming to the assumption that the, the the target, especially here in the UK, I'm assuming it's going to be the same in in, in any any other country. Um, majority they pick on females more than they do males. And the amount of females that are coming through, single females as well, that are dealing with this and have been dealing with this for so many years now. Um, they're reaching out and they're getting in touch and we're arranging um, links and possible interviews and testimonies to be filmed etc 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 so they've learned how to trust again they know that and and it's only and it's all come about through through obviously my youtube channel and the ti television concept uh, the work that um, kieran lee perrin and uh, and uh, jeff goodwin have been have been putting in uh, and obviously myself and um, the flyer campaign seems to be going from strength to strength um, like i mentioned you know the flight you know the contributions now have allowed me to sell these flyers to, to people for 12 pound 50 a pack um, plus the five pound postage now people are learning that we are we are working for the for the right side for the light side because that's where we are that's where we're coming from you know we are looking to help and assist and break this program as as fast and, and as and as professionally as we possibly can and the only way we're going to do that is by carry on doing what we're doing and trying to keep getting you guys to, to reach out and to get in touch you know with the flyer campaign and the documentaries etc etc you know we've, we've prop you know the, the numbers that are building the numbers are seriously building and um effectively that will lead lovely into um to what i want to talk about next um i've uh, over the past
I've had a, I've had a few uh, comments and, and emails sort of asking whether I have got any idea um, as to the numbers um, it, of uh, uh, targeted individuals or targeted survivors here in the UK and uh, to be honest I haven't I know that there must be thousands um, and I know that I've probably got about 200 UK based targeted individuals um, names um, that I am going to be um, uh, something an, another another new project that I'm going to be adding to the rest of the projects that, that we're doing. I mean, obviously, it seems never ending. This is this is definitely becoming a, a fully unpaid job, um, but it's still it's, it's it's essential. You know, somebody's got to start. Somebody's got to start putting all this information together. So effectively, um, I am going to be looking to start documenting and building a database of targeted survivors here in the UK. Um, we will obviously start with everybody that's been in touch um, through, uh, up through to myself and through to um, TI Television. This will be a completely and utterly confidential list um, and it will never be shown to anybody. It's an in-house um, database. Um, but basically what it will do is it will allow us to start getting some idea of not only graph, uh, uh, geographical uh, position, positionings of, um, of survivors and it seems to be as, as, as time goes on more and more survivors are coming uh, are coming through to us from the same areas um, and them, them same survivors don't know the other TIs in, their, in that area now what an opportunity that would be to start bringing you guys together and girls together you know, if we can put a database together and it turns out that you've got 10, we've got 10 credible, sensible, stable, intelligent, targeted individuals um, that have managed to learn and live with their targeting and cope with the everyday stress and um, disgusting, cowardly uh, attacks that, um, that, that just are a daily occurrence to a, to a targeted individual, then what's the odds? And then I can then start putting all of you guys together in a group for you to then start building a support network in your local areas. You know, I'm not going to mention areas at the moment, but I'm aware, you know, there's one area in particular, or one county in particular, and I've got over 10 um, survivors in that one area that I can possibly start linking and linking together and um, bringing together for your own local little community um, support network their main weapon is keeping you isolated their main weapon is to keep you away from specifically people like me and Kieran and TI television and also other survivors that may be living in your local vicinity so if that's the case then I need to work on the country and I need to start building a database and start connecting you guys and girls together um, from my end so basically what it's going to be doing is going to be um, counter um, counter attacking the, uh, the, pro the program and doing a complete reversal of what the program instills in the individual and what the program is all about. So rather than isolation and uh, singularity um, with the target individual I would love to be start putting handfuls of, of, uh, of TIs together um, in their local vicinities. Um, the same as what Laura is doing over in, over in, um, in Ireland um, I mean, I've, I've got, I've got. There's a good, probably half a dozen or so of the uh, TI survivors that have been in uh, in touch with me from from Wales. Not many from Scotland at the moment. Um, all all over the UK. You know, the network is building, and um, the numbers are are, are are coming through. And effectively, what I would like is, I would like um, anybody that feels that they have got the um, the courage, and they have got the trust then please email me your details of what your name is and what area you live in um, and obviously I will um, need that through a private email so please email me your details and your local area your vicinity that you're um, that you are uh, residing in um, through to Shane Gibbs 212 at gmail.com and effectively I will start putting a database of um, UK survivors um, together and as time moves forward as and when I get half a dozen or so targeted individuals in the in the same vicinity I will then start linking you all up together and putting you in touch with the other survivors that I have vetted that I feel comfortable with that I know and I and I trust but 
it's going to be a long process it's going to be a long process but i need you to start reaching out i need you to come forward with your name and with your local vicinity where you're living i will guarantee your information will be completely and 100 percent confidential it will not be passed on to anybody else until i have got like i say till i've got enough um, survivors in a particular area then i will contact all of you individually and and then put the idea of um, bringing you all together as a local community based group now i know a lot of people are not going to be um, not not going to be willing to do that you know especially the, the amount of people that have, have not even got the courage to um, well, well i'm not going to say courage because i know what this program does to you you know you've got these profiles that are, that are not using your real name you've got no profile picture um whether it be on facebook or whether it be on youtube you need to break free you need to learn to trust and you can trust us you can trust me you can trust tr television you can trust kieran lee perrin we are here to help we are here to bring light into this dark into this dark program it's got to be done you need to start breaking free you need to start learning how to trust so please 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 you know what i used to be a bit of a singer when i was younger i was in a choir and everything a cloud of boys <laughs> <coughs> um, yeah, yeah, quite strange as well. Was, um, I used to sing at weddings and I used to do solos and all sorts when I was a schoolboy. I was quite a, yeah, quite a talent. Um, so yeah, <coughs> excuse me. So please, 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 um, start emailing me um, your details. Um, email me your name. Email me your local vicinity so I can start adding you and including you into the uh, UK Survivors database. It's going to work. It's going to work in in, um, in 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 many ways. Not only will it allow me to start hooking up um, survivors in your local vicinities, but as and when I get enough, uh, you know, five or six um, survivors uh, in the Pacific area, then I will look to then form a uh, a, a collaboration, a a coalition, if you like, um, and bring small groups of you guys together, so you can then learn and start learning um, that you're not alone. You don't need to go through this alone. You don't need to fight this alone. At the moment, a lot of you are, and there's not a lot I can do about that. Um, we are still in, in the very, very early stages of, of what we're doing at TI Television, but um, the numbers are uh, the numbers are coming in. We've got another uh, we've got another weekend um, filming with uh, with three new survivors coming over to give their uh, to give their testimonies and introduce themselves to uh, to the channel at the weekend. Um, Hopefully I'll have my nice new baseball caps ready for then as well, and uh, it'll be TI televisioned up and all that. And um, so start reaching out. You know, you, you, by doing so, not only will you be added into the uh, added into the database that I'm that I, I've started already putting together, um, and it's, and it won't be online. It's literally a A, a to Z um, note, notebook, and I will be literally um, listing down. Um, survivors details and soon as like I say soon as I've got a certain amount in, in a certain area I will then link you all up um, I will contact you individually and will then start putting you in touch with each other so you can then start forming your own mini support groups in your local vicinity so email me shane gibbs 212 at gmail.com and um, and i will add you to the database and um, effectively uh, also keep your uh, your details um, to mind as to as as to as and when we get enough uh, or i get enough because this is something that i'm i'm taking on board of everything else it's another project that i feel is uh, is something that's uh, essentially needed now um, to start building up the network to start building you know because once you've got a team um, then your team can come and meet their team and their team can come and meet our team and we can have our own teams of teams and done team add us to another team and can you, can you see what I'm getting at? We need to start building the network, we need to start putting the numbers together, we need to start formulating support um, and start allowing survivors to learn how to be a human and trust again which you will do i can guarantee you and the same as what i've seen with my own eyes with some of the people that have come through to ti television they come in as a targeted individual they go out basically still a ti but as a with a certain level of humanity and trust installed in them just from one day 
How amazing would that be? How amazing would that be that if I can link up hundreds and hundreds of, of targeted survivors here in the UK to start forming your own teams in your own vicinities and maybe even give you the uh, take an idea out of, of what we're doing at TI Television and start building your own uh, platform um, and then link up with our platform. Strength in numbers, we need to start coming together and to, to, to alleviate the, the, the problem of, of everybody coming through and, and getting, because there's too many, there's, too, there's far too many coming through for us to be able to profile and travel around the UK to go, you know, the, the money's not there. Um, so effectively, what I uh, another you mean, there's, there is there are funds there enough to do what we can do and what we're doing at the moment. Um, but when it comes down to the the level of numbers, the amount of numbers that are coming through is astronomical. I knew that it was going to happen. I knew it was going to be happen. I knew it would happen. Um, so to to counter that, effectively, if I can start building a database and start bringing mini teams together in certain vicinities around the UK, what what a fantastic feeling I would get of kn of knowing how I've helped and how I've 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 not only brought you together um, I've I've given you the information and, and the and the arsenal to to be able to work as a team to learn to trust each other to bounce off each other you know to have that support network you, how, how do you know you might have a TI living just down the road from you that's living in isolation and because nobody knows, nobody's got it apart from the uh, apart from the pathetic um, dark side. You know, they obviously have got a database. <laughs> yeah, of course they have. Um, of of everybody that, that they've uh, they've got running through this program. So we need to now counteract that by building our own database and bringing you guys together in your local vicinities. The, it will continue with TI Television, and TI Television's numbers will continue to grow um, week on week on week on week. Um, that is the, the process is you know the ball's rolling it, it's working um, the flyers are going out um, the, so the numbers are there um, we just need to now organize uh, in, in as a professional and, and and realistic fashion as we possibly can you need to start learning to trust you need to start reaching out come through to me Put you, so allow me to put your details on my own personal database that I'm compiling for UK based um, targeted survivors and um, let me help and let me bring the community together but I'm not going to be able to do that if I've not got the information I need the information I need you to email me your vicinity your local area and um, and your name and and as and obviously once I, once we've done that, I can then uh, make contact with you if the um, <laughs> if they don't. I mean, maybe I need to get another phone with a different number because um, that that BlackBerry's definitely got some bugs in it. <laughs> so to guys, um, learn to trust, come together, start working. Let me let me work. You know, I'm, 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 I want to help. I want to do this work. I, I'm, I need to do this work. I need to start helping more TIs. I need to start helping more survivors. And the, the only way that I can see that in the bigger picture, especially here in the UK, is if you start coming together, if you trust me, then please, please, please come through to me. Give me your details. Give me your vicinity and uh, and your contact details, and, and we can chat on the phone. And um, and and obviously we can we can get um, we can build up a rapport over the phone. And once we've done that, we'll stay in touch. I mean, it's like I say to everyone that um, everyone that I speak to, um, feel free to, to to call me and feel free to, to contact me with any anything. You know, even if you just feel like you need a chat for five or ten minutes, um, please do that. And and people up. Um, but there's only a certain amount of, of, uh, of minutes in the day for me, um, the same as there is for you guys. So if I can start bringing mini teams together, if I can start bringing local community teams together around the around the country, um, that that is well. <laughs> we need to start doing this to get this program exposed and acknowledged is going to take it's going to take time it's going to but to actually alleviate the um, the isolation can can happen a lot quicker if you learn to trust if you come forward i'll do the rest of the work i've got no problem doing that um 
but I can't do that without your assistance. I cannot do that unless you come forward to me. I cannot start putting this database together until I've got the, the data to put into the list to then start working out how I can bring some of you guys together in your local facilities. So please, please, please have a think about that. Um, anybody else um, that has got any ideas, um, then please email me um, directly through to my uh, email account, shanegibbs212 at gmail.com. Um, I need to cut this video a little bit short today because I've got to go down the post and uh, yeah, it's rent rent day as well so I need to go down the bank and pay the rent. A um, couple of other bits and pieces and jobs to get done. So um, that just about sums up what I wanted to today. So please, please, listen, this, this is not going to work. This is not going to, if you remain in silence, um, you, will, you will be a victim to the program. They will never leave you alone. They will continue your persecution and your victimization and your daily torrent of torture. Start coming together, start reaching out. If, if you don't want to get involved with the TR television, get involved, give me your details so I can start putting a database together of UK survivors and start bringing you guys together in your local facilities. It's, like I said, I've already got enough now to bring a, a certain, a couple of teams together in their local facilities. But this is just another little idea that, that, that um, has cha -ching, light bulb moment chain um, has come through, and I think that it's going to be um, an essential part of the uh, of the activism and uh, an essential part of uh, aiding and helping um, targeted individuals regain their humanity and regain the, their trust in fellow victims. Um, we don't want egotistics, we don't want egos, we don't need leaders, we don't need champions, we don't need ambassadors, we don't need presidents. So if you've got an ego, don't do egos man. Egotistic TIs um, do worry me, to be honest with you. Um, there, there are so many TIs out there that feel that they have got some kind of superiority over, uh, over and above every other survivor, we're all human. We're all the same, we come in the same, we go out the same. Nobody is better than anybody else, especially within the TI community, if you are genuine. So any egos, I'm not interested. You know, if you want to, um, if, if you're that egotistic, then why aren't you doing what I'm doing here? If you're that egotistic and you're that, um, you, you're that uh, certain that, um, that your situation is so much whatever compared to anybody else's and that you are a born leader and you want to be the president and all that sort of stuff um, go and crack on it's not what the CR community needs um, as I've mentioned and I will continue mentioning but on a positive note please 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 come forward anybody else that wants to get involved with the National Fly campaign please 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 email me direct Shane Gibbs 212 at gmail.com and we can talk about how, you're, uh, how you want to get involved with the National Fly campaign um, and that basically oh no there's, um, there is something else um, somebody pulled me up on um, can, let me just uh, let me just, just say I have got absolutely nothing and I mean nothing against any other a human being on this planet unless you're a perpetrator then I hate you because you're scum but when it comes down to and it's my fault and um, and I'm, I'm quite happy that somebody pulled pulled me up on it when I was um, talking about uh, the two uh, the two Freemasons and um, possibly being more than best friends I used the uh, I used quite a nasty word and um, and I think that um, the, I shouldn't have used that particular word I'm not homophobic I'm not Islamophobic I'm not I haven't got any phobia at all to be honest with you. Um, so I must apologise to any any of the um, any 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 of you guys out there that uh, have got um, your own preferential sexual preference, um, whether you're gays or lesbians or transgender or what, what have you. Um, I I apologise from uh, from the, the bottom of my heart. I uh, I, I definitely meant no offence by utilising. I just get so angry. I get so angry. Um, by thinking about the, the the MPs that have been involved and the Freemasons that have been involved in, you know, I, I do tend to go off on a little bit of a tangent. Um, but um, I'm definitely, definitely, definitely not homophobic. I've got nothing against gay people. Um, effectively, I've got quite a few gay people as friends, and um, there's actually a certain uh, I've got a cousin who's a, who's a, who's a homosexual, and um, 
and, and it's, it, it makes no difference to me. You know, if you're a decent human being, no matter what your uh, what your orientation is, it, it makes no difference to me. Um, so I must apologise for that um, for that using that word. I know it's a very nasty word when it comes down to uh, addressing the uh, the um, the gay community, and uh, and I meant no malice in it at all. And um, and please, please, please don't uh, don't keep that against me and use that against me. If you are if you are gay or lesbian or of a different sexual orientation, please, 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 you will all you're all needed. You're all welcome. I I, I mean that. Um, so I don't take my um, my big mouth uh, and my little rants about um, when I when I do get a little bit emotional about talking about um, especially my personal targeting. I do tend to uh, put my uh, foot in my mouth every now and then, and for that I must apologise and uh, and I'm and I'm deeply sorry. So I meant no um, I meant no offence, and I really really hope that that hasn't dissuaded or. Um, caused any form of judgment um, from any gay, lesbian or uh, trans people out there that are targeted and uh, they feel that um, they want to get involved but maybe because they heard that comment in, uh, in, a, previous, uh, in a previous video um, I'm sorry and I, I, and I meant nothing by it it was definitely not targeted towards anybody else other than then to Damien, Damien Green and uh, Gerard Brown the, um, the buddies, the Freemason buddies so uh, yeah, apologise for that. Um, it was definitely wasn't intended um, to, with any malice, and um, and anybody is welcome. Please, please, please come forward, and um, let's start working. Let's start working together. Let me start working for you. Let me start putting this database together and start bringing teams of survivors together in your local facilities all the way around the UK. We can do this. We can do this. I can't do it on my own. But I can be a central hub and help bring you guys together as long as you come through to me. I will vet every one of you. I will contact every one of you individually. I will then put the database together and then start forming the teams. And then again, I will then communicate directly individually um, and put the ideas to uh, to to the survivors in question and um, and hopefully start bringing um, teams of uh, teams of survivors together in local facilities across the UK. So that just about sums up today's video. Um, I hope you're all doing as well as you possibly can be. Never give in. Never, ever, ever give in. All you um, Irish TIs out there, please get in touch with Laura. I mean, she's doing some sterling work over there. She's doing. She's a courageous, courageous lady. And um, I, I'm not quite sure of the numbers that are, um, that, are that she's hoping to um, to get to a, a meeting that she's arranged. Uh, I'm not going to start giving dates and details because it's not my uh, it's not my place to do that. But if you can go on to um, if you look at targeted in individual island um, and contact um, contact Laura directly, um, I'm sure she will be very very pleased to um, to to hear from you and uh, possibly um, start bringing the uh, the TI community in the in Ireland together and. Um, Forming the uh, forming the coalition, you know, we need to start bringing this to light. But to start with, we need to get TIs to be able to trust. We need to get TIs linked. We need together together in the local facilities. We need to start working as human beings and as not as targeted individuals. To learn, we need to learn how to be human again. So that just about sums up today's video. I've got to shoot off, like I mentioned. I've got to go down the post and get these flies out and um, and do a few other few bits and pieces and a few more chores down in the in the town centre. So, TIs, I hope you're all doing well and. Um, Hopefully, I'll get back to you uh, in the next couple of days with um, with some more some more uh, information and another video. There are a few more topics and bits and pieces that I want to talk to you to talk to you about. But I think the um, the trust element and the the, uh, the the UK survivor database that I want to start putting together that I've already started putting together, if I'm honest. Um, let me do the work. You just need to find the courage to come forward. Come forward to me. I'll put you in the database. I will contact you directly, um, and I will start putting teams of, of UK survivors together in your local facilities. Let's let's do this, people. Let's do this. Let's make this happen. Let's make this succeed. We will succeed. I just want to do it. I just want it to succeed a lot quicker than what um, than, than what it's going through than what it's apparent at the moment. And and if I can start bringing teams of you guys together in your local facilities. You know that's a big win-win for me, absolute win-win for me. So um, stay strong, stay defiant. Um, 
once again apologies to uh, for using the uh, the nasty language um, that I used in the previous video about the uh, sexual orientation of uh, Gerard Brown and um, the MP Damien Green. I wonder where they are actually. I wonder if they are good buddies. Not that it makes any difference. But I wonder where they are. Mm. Never one for me to ponder. So to you guys, until next time, um, please, please, please stay safe. Look out for yourself and uh, start reaching out, getting through to me. All UK TIs, please, please, please come through to me with your details. I will, start, I will then in, in, include you and input your information into my database that I'm putting together. Completely confidential. Don't worry about um, the information being put anywhere else apart from in my possession. It will go nowhere else. I, I promise you, I hand on heart, your information will be as safe as houses with me. Um, what I'm looking to do is going to help you all in the long run. So the more of you that come through, the more teams that I can start bringing together, the more survivors I can start helping, the more survivors can start helping themselves. So until next time, thanks YouTube for uh, allowing this content to be shown on your platform. And TIs, remain strong, remain defiant, never give up the fight, never ever ever give up the fight. Reach out, get come through to me, get on this database, let me start putting teams of survivors together in your local vicinity, because you don't know. You might have 10 TIs living within a, a, a one mile radius of your property. How do you know that? Well, the only way you're gonna know is by letting me let you know, which means I need your information. I need your, your name and your vicinity through an email, so I can then start contacting you individually and start working at putting groups together in your local vicinity. So, TIs, until next time, um, please, please, please try and take on board some of the information that I've given out in this video. And um, and I will see you all again very, very soon. Hopefully in the next few days, I'll get back to you with another video. So until then, you take care and uh, bye for now. Take care, take care, people, and, and I'll see you all again real soon. Bye for now.